The Vien Cong Man Y Shoji has recovered from a serious knee injury, with victory at the Asian Fencing Championships. After an anterior cruciate ligament operation 10 months ago, the 24-year-old became the first female from Hong Kong to win a gold at the regional championships with victory in the women's epee in Bangkok on Tuesday. Last summer in front of a packed crowd at the Asia World Expo, Kong was close to taking Asian gold when she led Kong young Wee of South Korea 12-8 before losing 13-12. But Kong claimed things never happen the same way twice after beating the same opponent 10-9 on Tuesday. Dr. Patrick Young Xu Hang, who conducted the knee operation for Kong, was not surprised to see the speedy recovery of the fencer, praising Kong as one of the strongest of the thousand athletes he has performed ACL surgery on. Physically, mentally and psychologically she is one of the best. I did my job as usual and she is the key anchor of her own success, said Young, an orthopedic surgeon at Prince of Wales Hospital. The world number 16 already held a Hong Kong record after she became the first fencer from the city to win an Olympic bout at the 2016 Rio Games before falling in the last 16. And it was not only Kong that achieved the success in Bangkok. Starring in her first Asian Championships, 17-year-old Kaylin Shea Sinyan captured a bronze medal. Shea, who won the World Cadet Championships in April, thrashed world number 2 Sun Yu Wen of China 15-10 in the round of 16 before losing to Kong in the semi-finals. Why is the Asian fencing champion missing the Asian Games? Hong Konger only has himself to blame another Hong Konger, Coco Lin Yik Hei, also reached the quarter-finals and lost to Shea. The trio will make a formidable combination when they start in the team event on Friday. Hong Kong has already won five individual medals at the tournament, with Chung Su Loon capturing a gold in the men's foil and Fong Hoi Sun and Lam Hin Wai taking bronze in the men's epee and women's sabre respectively.